Hey the bugs! Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley B. Deck. Today I'm going to be doing a start to finish lace wig install. This one comes courtesy of Kalai Hair. They sent over this beautiful auburn copper colored water wave lace wig. You'll see me install her straight out of the box. You guys can see she's giving scalp and beautiful hairline. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the video. This is the packaging and how she comes straight out of the box. You guys already know they gave us some free goodies and I'll show you guys that at the at the end of the video. This is the beginning. This one here is a 13 by 4 lace front wig and as you guys can see she's nice and gorgeous. You do have free parts so you can part from ear to ear. Um, also it does come with this adjustable elastic band that also can be removed. I'm going to go ahead and put my wig on and I had hair all in my face so excuse the facial expressions but this is a look at the hair texture as well as the hair quality as well as the hair color. I'm loving this color against my complexion. The green in my robe is also helping it to pop. So we're going to keep this robe on today. Here I am just going ahead and customizing the fit of the wig by cutting off the excess lace around the ear. This one was pretty perfect so I didn't really have to cut into the actual lace, more so just the excess lace that was, you know, hanging onto the sides. Here, Here's what it looks like set as a center part. I had already decided I wanted that sexy va va boom that the like flip over method kind of gives. So we're just going to go ahead and work on the install. I wanted to show you a few pictures on the page, the sales page of this wig on the website. Three beautiful queens that were representing or rocking the wig um, and how they styled it. Now I'm going to go ahead and give my own little twist, but I just kind of wanted to look at the, you know, pictures for inspo to see, you know, how the girls were wearing this one. I did go ahead and open up the hairline a little bit by just tweezing from ear to ear. To me, it was already pre-plugged and if I wouldn't have done anything, it would have looked amazing. But of course, it's always a step above to just go ahead and add your own little touch. So I'm just using these, this even product. I'm using the yellow. I added a generous amount around uh, the entire perimeter of the hairline, dabbing off the excess with a towel and then placing my melt belt so that I can go ahead and um, allow it to pretty much dry on its own while I work on the ends. Now working with wavy or even curly hair, I think it's a great idea to just go ahead and comb it out and detangle. It may not be tangled as in like ratty hair, but more so um, because the hair is wavy, it's naturally going to want to, you know, connect and locked up. And you just kind of want to pull that apart so that when you rub your fingers through, you know, it'll be nice and luxurious. So here I am after I remove the melt belt. It was dry. It was about 90% dry already, but I just wanted to give it a little bit more dry so that it's completely, completely dry. And here I am just deciding and being sure that I wanted to just keep it as a no part look. And I definitely did. So we're going to go ahead and cut off the excess lace using an eyebrow razor. Now, as I mentioned, you can definitely part it however you'd like. I decided to go ahead and tweeze this one more so because I knew I did not want to um, add any parting. And I feel like when you do a no parting look, that hair line has to be super flawless for you to really really pull it off in a flawless way so that is why I went ahead and tweezed the hairline but you definitely don't have to do that step now I did decide at the last minute that I did want baby hair and sideburns this is just true to what I like so I went ahead and just did what I was feeling the sideburns definitely were a little bit more fuller than they had to be um so you'll see it'll come together and it's going to look good regardless it's going to look flawless but here you guys can see I did do some pretty full sideburns and I'm going to add these little two swoops one above each of the eyebrows so it's going to come together beautifully especially once we tint that lace but again if it's too full you can send some of the hair back even now that I've cut it down I can definitely thin that out and just add some of that hair you know back with the rest of the hair using my wax stick. And you guys can see I didn't do like the wispy baby hair method with the curling iron. Um, I just used a little bit of my edge control from BDACBD.com and even a little bit of that even product to give it a little bit of a hold so that it can go ahead and mold itself down. And now it's coming together. I'm going to use this foundation powder from Ruby Kiss to go ahead and melt everything and kind of bring it home as far as tinting the lace and making sure everything blends and melts. Now what I love about this powder is that it blends on the lace with my skin with 
or without makeup i know that sometimes you guys will ask if you wear makeup is it going to be the same um yes and that's why i like this one because it's not necessarily my foundation shade but it's a more of a contour shade that works perfectly in a cool tone so that whether i'm wearing um makeup or not it's going to look good and now here we are i was pretty much done i did kind of play with it and decide i wanted to add product i did not want to wet it down at all no water no mousse i wanted it to be more of uh in its natural state so i did use this ogx um hair serum i guess you would call it just to give it more of that shiny wet look but without actually wetting it and i absolutely love 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 the way it came out if i did not mention this is a 13 by 4 lace front wig water wave texture and 20 inches in length the density is 150 percent density and this auburn copper color is so popping i did want to show you guys the packaging as i did uh promise in the beginning inside they did give us a melt belt and it has that beautiful green color also this mesh bag did come with your hd wig caps another melt belt your eye uh, lashes, your kabuki brush, as well as these beautiful pastel hair clips that I love so much. I already have a set from Kalai, so I'm happy to have a second set. I love this hair. It's absolutely gorgeous. Be sure to check the description box for a coupon code to save some money on this wig or any wig you like from their website. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and share with your friends. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches!